Holy crap, it is definitely not a crapple. Capture nah, I'm just playing. But it is your boy Handicap, and uh, yeah, this would be my first Export. ever okay. gameplay slash commentary. And of all maps, I'm doing it on probably one of the best in this game, firing range. Um, I know you guys probably don't see a lot of headquarters games put up, but yeah, I'm putting one up because, first of all, I just completely annihilate the other team. I believe I go 50 and 15, and uh, yeah, I play the objective pretty damn well in this game. And oh, forgot to say, definitely using the sexiest gold gun you can get. And probably one of my top three favorite guns, if not my most favorite gun of all guns. Yeah, stake out. And yeah, Jimmy, I said stake out, not stake out. I know I'm Canadian, but I still said stake out. So leave me alone. I'm running. I'm pretty sure I'm running. Yeah, I'm running Flat Jacket Pro, Sleight of Hand Pro, and uh, Marathon Pro with uh, UAV, uh, Napalm, and a Blackbird. I'm usually going for the non lethal kill streaks like you guys all see Steve and Ernie run because I guess they call it the non lethal movement. Well, we've all joined it, so. But I just find it way too good to uh, not run Napalm on headquarters. Just the whole, you can cut them off and uh, hold them from the objective for an extra little bit of time is nice. Oh, I better stop talking for a second here. I do want a pretty good run by myself. My whole team's already dead, so I, yeah, I pick up a second stakeout just because that's just how I roll. But yeah, I know how most people think shotguns in this game are absolutely terrible, or maybe not absolutely terrible, but very, very bad. Um, I actually find them quite enjoyable to use, especially the stakeout. Uh, pretty much, I'd have to say that's my favorite shotgun. But, yeah, I don't know. If you guys uh, like the shotguns or not, that's understandable if you don't. But I just don't like using the typical 74U or FAMAS setup that 90% of people use. And I'm alright at sniping, but I'm definitely no quick scoper by any means. And yeah, I'm stupid enough to actually run back right now and try to kill that guy again that just killed me. And uh, yeah, it doesn't work out good in my favor for uh, the second time. But that's, that's usually what happens when you know where the guy is and you try to get him. Um, I'm pretty sure we end up winning 250 to 0 or 250 to 10. I can't remember, but I know we end up just slaughtering this team. Because, uh, yeah, they could not get any of the objectives. We just held them off way too well. I'd usually be running... Oh, no, no. Actually, you know what? I'm not running. Marathon Pro, I remember now. I am running Tactical Mask Pro because it is the best third perk you can probably choose, especially for a headquarters game. I just remember because I flashed myself and it didn't really do anything. Um, yeah, I'm playing with a couple buddies of mine. Uh, I usually have a morning crew and a night crew, and this is my morning crew. And it's uh, Mr. Rated R and I think Slugger. But, yeah, so. This is uh, just proof that the shotguns are not as bad as everybody says they are, or thinks they are. But anyways, back to my, uh, more about me, I guess. Everyone, pretty much once a week, actually I get a message almost once every week saying, are you actually handicapped? Or in the lobby I get the random comment, are you actually handicapped? No, I am definitely not handicapped. And uh, I didn't make the name to make fun of the handicapped at all either, of course. Uh, basically, I've had this name, yeah, for quite a long time. Since about back in 2000, probably, when original SOCOM for PS2 came out. I played that online like a madman. Probably more than I even play COD. But that's just uh, what happened, yeah. I picked a pretty uh, unoriginal name first and got sick of it after about a month. And it's like, alright, I need a very original name that hopefully not too many people use and I definitely think I found one so that's one good thing at least oh yeah I definitely am running jammers on headquarters because I think they're just one of the best uh, what's the word I'm looking for not perks one of the best things you can run besides a claymore I just like the whole not knowing where you're shooting from inside the uh, actual headquarters itself is great anyways yeah um, You've probably already seen, if you guys are coming from Steve's channel, or from Ernie's channel, or Jimmy's channel, any of those three, I'm sure you've seen my name pop up more than once at least while you've watched their videos. 
I uh, frequently play with those three guys a lot. Actually, I've been getting Jimmy or Jay Brooks, as some of you might know, I'm depending. I've been getting Jimmy or Jay Brooks uh, to actually pick up the stakeout myself, too. He, uh, he's starting to really get into it. I'm loving it. It's fun just running around with a shotgun. But, yeah, besides... Uh, oh, that was a nice triple kill, actually, by Mr. Rated R. Wish I would have switched to him so you guys could have saw that. A nice RPG triple there. But, um, yeah. So, headquarters. I don't know. Some people love it. Some people hate it. I definitely would have to be one of the top... One of my top three playlists. I definitely love it. Uh, probably more than even Domination. Just, I like the fact that people can't camp back usually as much on headquarters because they have to go for the objective. Definitely my all-time favorite, if you have a great team, is the demo. You can just absolutely run a train on people on demo. They, they can't even get out of their spawn if you know what you're doing on each map, which is good. Well, it's good, but it's not good. Just sometimes it's too easy. Half the time you're fighting over who gets to call what in, too. So. No, but Headquarters is probably one of my favorite games for ranking up to. I find you get tons of points on Headquarters. On average, I think I probably get usually, I'm pretty much done prestiging now, so. But while I was actually prestiging to get to 14, I'm pretty sure I usually got between 15 and 20,000 XP every single game, which is amazing. So, yeah, I can't, definitely couldn't complain about the points. But, uh, yeah, back to the stakeout. Um, I don't know if any of you guys watch any of the actual gun videos people have put up, but the reason pretty much every shot I take I aim down sights for is the fact that the stakeout has definitely the closest spread bullets wise for any of the shotguns that you can actually get. I know you see a lot of those videos where people get their three or four man sprays with a spaz but it's uh, not very common to say the least let alone even a two two shot spray on one guy to get a kill. See here we go this guy got three. I took three. He was pretty far away though. So, but yeah, I'm definitely I play the objective like crazy on headquarters. I uh, I hate losing, so that's why I, I play the objective as much as possible. I just don't like to lose. But that just comes with I don't think any game you play or any kind of sport or whatever I guess you're into. I don't think anybody likes to lose. But I think I definitely played the objective pretty well in this game. Oh, I'm running Semtex for obvious reasons. And I think I hear, yeah, I call my napalm in right here on the objective because I know there's two guys on it. The third guy I think has a shotgun here. Yep, there he is. He had, he had TAC, or not TAC, Black Jacket Pro anyway, so we really wouldn't have mattered if I called it in on him. You'll see in a second. He'll be in the flames trying to destroy the objective here after he kills me, I'm pretty sure. But that's what happens. I love Black Jacket Pro for that reason. Have to run it. Headquarters, if you don't play with Flak Jacket Pro, you're pretty much wasting your time. Or not Pro, even Flak Jack in general. It's pretty much a waste of time. Uh, yeah, most. Hopefully, this is the first of many of my commentaries coming up. So, and yes, most of my commentaries or my gameplays will be with a shotgun of some kind. Whether it be the Olympia, the Spaz, or Spaz, whatever the actual proper name is or the Olympia stakeout regardless you probably won't see too many of them with an HS10 I just despise that gun with a passion I know Ernie has gotten some amazing gameplays with it but I uh, yeah I'm not a big fan of a Kimbo weapon so you probably won't see me use that gun very often if at all most of them will be with my stakeout um, definitely my favorite gun especially shotguns but yeah, I think uh, I think we cap this one and hold it for the remainder. I can't remember. No, there's another mine. We don't actually. I won't lie. But I get a nice little streak going here again too. I think I get a second Blackbird on this one. This team we we're playing, uh, they tried. I'll give them that. They did try. They tried to get the objectives. They just could never hold them. We just had a. We actually had some good randoms on my team for once, which was nice. Usually I am stuck with the guys that don't play or they just don't understand or grasp the whole concept of how to play headquarters. I, you know, I think it's one of the simplest 
objective games to understand how to play for the obvious reason that, you know, yeah, see, right there would have been great to have a spaz because I could have just spammed eight bullets off very quickly. But, oh well, uh, you know, you win some, you lose some. And then this guy. Oh, sorry, I burped. My bad. Uh, hold on, I need a drink here for a second. Uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure this is the last uh, target, and my team gets it here. Yep, gotta love the jammer. But, uh, yeah. Otherwise, if I don't run jammers, I think I usually run tack insert, just so I know I spawn near the objective when I die, so I can help cap the damn thing. Yeah, but yeah, these guys pretty much gave up a while ago. Like, oh, watch this. This is great up here. I turn on the guy in this little crow's nest, I guess if that's what you call it. He uh, he got shot on pretty much. Yep, yeah, say goodnight. Bye-bye. And my team right now, the randoms are actually capturing it, which is kind of nice. Yeah, I'm a dumbass. I fell. Shut it. So, yeah, there we got the headquarters, and uh, this game is almost ready to wrap up here. Take a quick steal of uh, Sam Turret. Toss it down and uh, go for the objective now to help defend it. So, yeah. Oh, no, I don't even go for the defend. Never mind. I just go back to kill this guy and get a couple more kills. Game is pretty much done otherwise. So, yeah. Glad you guys, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Um, please like, favorite, comment, whatever you guys got to do. Just do it. Thanks, boys.